Hello students. In the previous class, we had completed here till the topic types of crops. Okay. Now, today, we will talk about agricultural practices. Okay. So, let's start. First of all, growing crops is a multi-step process. Okay. That means there are so many steps to cultivate any crop. We refer to all these tasks as agriculture practices. So there are some following steps as given below. First, preparation of soil. Second, seed selection and sowing. Third one, adding manure and fertilizers. Fourth, irrigation. Fifth, protection from weeds. Sixth, harvesting. And seventh, storage. Now we come to the first point, the preparation of soil. So the first and one of the most important step in the process of crops production is the preparation of soil. Okay, we prepared soil by turning and loosening it and the process of turning and loosening of the soil is known as pluffing. Okay. Okay now after the soil preparation the next step is to sow the seed in it. But the most important thing is that the seed should be healthy. If we sow the unhealthy seed our plant won't grow. So this is a process of seed selection. And once seed selection is done, seeds are shown in the soil. The following points must be kept in the mind while sowing seeds. Okay, The first one is the soil must be well watered. What is the meaning of the soil must be well watered? This is because seeds require moisture for germinating. If the soil is dry, seeds will not germinate properly. Okay. The next, seeds must be sown neither too deep nor on the surface of the soil. Why? If seeds are sown too deep in the soil, then they will not be able to respire. If seeds are sown on the surface of the soil, they are at the risk of being of being eaten by birds okay next kya hai? seeds must be sown at an appropriate distance from one another why because this helps to avoid overcrowding and competition for sunlight nutrition etc etc okay 